Hello YouTube, this is my first video. I'm doing a video on my Most in the Gaunt rifle my friends bought for me for my birthday. I have shot two deer with this gun. I got to keep one. One got away. We found the next day dead, sadly. These are the bullets that go into it. See, I bought stripper clips for it. They come in really handy for reloading it nice and fast if you're at the range or anything like that. And I've seen a lot of tutorials online for learning how to shoot this thing and how to load it and how to clean it. And that's come in really handy because I wouldn't have not known how to do any of that if it wasn't for YouTube. So I took my first deer with this gun at about 80 yards. It was a quick headshot. It just fell down. Might as well just take this out. You guys don't think it floated or anything. Sorry for the noise in the background. My sister is cooking. So, anyways, um, yeah, I like this gun. As you can see, I put the synthetic stock on it. It didn't have this at first. It had a wooden stock. Um, my thoughts on it, it makes it easier to hit stuff at long distances. I mean, I didn't have anything to rest my gun on, and it really came in handy with that long. It was about an 80-yard shot, and I know I wiggle a lot at, like, 80 yards, especially with the trigger on this gun. So, non-iron sights, it really helped, so it doesn't look the same. I had the wooden stock on it when I killed the deers, but I don't know. I've tried all sorts of stuff with this gun. I tried putting a scope on it, and I didn't really like it because it didn't work so well. I'm thinking I might put a red dot sight on it, but I might. I think I'm just going to keep it the way it is. It was 100 bucks. I'm not going to put any more money into it. I have a really good 270 rifle I might do a video on. That's much better gun. Yeah, and I got this gun at Gander Mountain. They were having a special for like it was a special. It was like a hundred bucks, and uh, all my friends did chip in for it for me for my birthday. So I was very grateful to get this gun. So I didn't mind spending a little extra money putting some money into the stock because I didn't I didn't pay for the gun. But either way, it's pretty cool. Either way, it's pretty cool. I really like it. There's a lot of hate on this gun, though. When you go to gun ranges, they're like, oh, you can't use steel cases, and they want to check the gun, and the moment they see it's a most in the gun, they're like, oh, no, you can't shoot it here. No target shooting here. I had to target shoot at the place where I was going hunting only the first day before I went hunting, and that's how I had to learn how to shoot the gun before I shot my deer. changed so much about the gun except that um, it looks different, and... I take advantage of the fact that it has a plastic stock and I put stuff in the stock for when I go hunting. I put like toilet paper, you know, you, it comes in really handy when you're going hunting. I don't know if y'all have gone hunting, but there's no toilet paper out there. And uh, I don't know, I put like a compass and like a fire starter and all sorts of stuff, extra bullets. So, comes in handy. Alright, I'm going to sign off and I might do another gun tutorial on some of my other guns. Thanks, bye.